And now for a very sensitive subject. Whether it be your girlfriend, husband, boss, or even kids, some information needs to stay personal, your eyes only. Today we're going to talk about a piece of software called TrueCrypt. With it, you can encrypt your personal files so that only you can access them. All links are in the video description. The first thing we need to do is download TrueCrypt. You can download TrueCrypt from TrueCrypt.org. Then install it and then restart the computer. Once you have restarted, run TrueCrypt. In TrueCrypt, press the button labeled Create Volume. Now select Create an Encrypted File Container. Now select Standard TrueCrypt Volume. Select the location to save your TrueCrypt volume. This screen is where you select your encryption algorithm. In most cases, you will use the AES encryption. Now select the desired volume size for your encrypted space. Here is the meat and potatoes of TrueCrypt. Here you can set a password for your encrypted space. Or even better, use key files. Key files are files that function as a password. Select the Use Key Files checkbox. Then select anywhere from one to several files to use as key files. Make sure not to lose the key files. Without them, you will not be able to decrypt your TrueCrypt volume. Here, select your file system as NTFS, then press Format. You have now created an encrypted space where you can store your personal files. Now we can start protecting our valuable information from prying eyes. Using TrueCrypt is really easy. First, go to the folder where you made your encrypted volume. Double click the file and when Windows asks, what program would you like to open this file with? Select TrueCrypt. After TrueCrypt opens, click the mount button. Now, type your password or if you used key files, press the key file button and add your key files. With key files added, press OK, and then OK again. Now you see that your volume has been mounted. If you go to My Computer, you will see what appears to be a brand new additional hard drive. This is my TrueCrypt volume. What we can do now is move a file that we want to protect in this volume, and then dismount the volume. Doing this will lock the file in the volume until we decrypt the TrueCrypt volume again. As you can see, TrueCrypt is a great way to lock away sensitive information. If you like what you see and you want more, do yourself a favor and click the subscribe button. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Bye. If you have any ideas that you think would make a great video, Please send us a message.